<laughs> Tomorrow, I'm going to be cutting off all my hair. <laughs> what goes up? Fall through like Santa Claus Ho, ho, ho's on my balls I don't need a hand I don't need no applause I know Guys, um, before I even explain the statement I just said um, Let me introduce myself I'm Zenia, Zenia Lydia But you call me Zen for short Because for some people, my name's complicated Question mark, question mark <laughs> So I haven't posted in a while And I think it's Honestly, because I haven't found self-motivation just to expand myself and just venture out of my comfort zone. So, I guess I started examining my comfort zone and what I found that built up my wall, um, is what I'm saying. What helped build the box that I seem to be trapped in. And one of them is my hair. <laughs> So I just want to say, um, the person that actually triggered my thinking about this and actually made me like look at myself in the mirror and really evaluate my relationship with my hair is Nia Light on um, Instagram. I hope that's her Instagram name. <laughs> but she had these beautiful curls and she cut them and she's still beautiful and she spoke about how she started to become her hair. And, um, you know that saying where people are like, I am not my hair, well, she felt like she was, and I do too. Um, I find comfort in my hair. I feel like I am only pretty because of my hair, almost as if my beauty is only attached to my coils. And it makes me <laughs> very uncomfortable to realize that and to talk about it and to be like a hundred percent vulnerable <sighs> because I think I make myself to be very self-assured and confident in myself but I do still have like a lot of insecurities about myself that I really want to deal with I felt like a lot of people said oh you're so beautiful it's the hair and I sort of hid behind my hair and sort of relied on my hair to make people even recognize me I feel a lot of people I feel like a lot of people recognize me because of my hair. Oh, you're the girl with the afro. Because they don't really know much about me. Um, I guess I, I, I'm funny, whatever, but I never really open up to a lot of people, which is fine. You don't have to. Your circle can be small. But I feel like with my ambition and my dreams and my goals, I should at least try or at least want to talk to people. And I haven't wanted to because that is not within the walls of my box and so this year and not even year it doesn't matter what year it is I'm just gonna do it I'm cutting off my hair because I don't like how dependent I am of it that's my fear codependency I don't want to depend on inanimate that I don't want to depend on an animate object or something as materialistic as my hair Although I love my hair and it's a part of who I am, I want to learn how to love myself without it so that I could love myself even more with it. Um, so this is me challenging myself and I'm going to cut off my hair and yep, yeah, I'm like breathing so hard and like I'm by myself and I'm breathing so hard just talking about it. Uh, I feel like sometimes you have to cut yourself down to watch yourself grow again and I think that's exactly what I'm doing <laughs> lastly I've been talking a lot I feel like thank you for even clicking on this video and coming on this journey with me and I hope you enjoy this and I am back I'm saying this please hold me accountable I'm trying to be better so let's go make me uncomfortable <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> what goes up?
system up. Fall through like Santa Claus. Ho, 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 the ball. I don't need a hand. I don't need no applause. I know who I am. Ain't shit I have to prove to y'all. Ain't shit I have to prove for y'all. I'ma just grab the juice from y'all. Come on, man, happy you a saw. I don't need attitude from y'all. You can't put my back against the wall. I know when I have to get involved. Mind your goddamn business. You don't always have to get involved. If that girl is with it, then I'm gonna have to tell her like, whoa, yo, ass is like, whoa. Yo, body like, whoa, why you got me like, whoa, can't get out of my zone, going hard cause I ain't know, I'm accomplish my goal, I don't do what they do, but I promise I look, check me out. I stand by every word, look, I'm out here trying to make a change, boy. Rummy, me, do my thing, boy. Rummy, me, do my thing, boy. Why oh, you never say it like it is, bro? Why you trying to play with the kid, bro? You don't even play with your kids, bro. Moving like a train this bitch, bro. If you in the way, you get hit, bro. So I'm going major with this. DMV metro area shit, What goes up? Yeah. Hold on. come down. Pulling up, yeah. Windows down, yeah. System up, yeah. Hear the sound. I make your feelings change when I'm around, yeah What goes up, must come down, yeah. Pulling up It is the next day, in the morning actually And I am very happy <laughs> with my hair um, It didn't turn out the way I thought it was gonna look But that's good I'm so excited, I could finally wear a hat, y'all Hats. I look good in hats. Oh. oh, I'm so happy. I want to get like bandanas and tie them up. Mmm. It looks so cute. I'm really excited. The girl in my hair was amazing. Her name is Lorraine. And the salon is pricier than what I would normally go for. But if you do have money, you should go. And I would tell you where it is, right? But then it like. It's such a small town, right, that you may try to hurt me. <laughs> so, if you actually DM me on my Instagram, and I think you're an actual real life person and stuff, I'll, I'll give you her, her address so you can make an appointment. Because she did a really good job. I think that's it. I think that's enough for the video. I think the video is long enough already. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope you got something out of it. And I hope when you challenge yourself, it will be just as great as mine. Whatever that may be. So, like this video if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see my face again. And comment down below what is something you're insecure about. I will see you guys in my next video. Until next time. It's been a while since I said this. Until next time, stay absolutely beautiful. Mm.